Worst persons ahead, first night's quick comment. Well, it's the standard liberal clap trap. Somebody on the far, far right goes way too far with their new language of violence, especially gun violence, and then comes the immediate outcry that we have to back away from the edge of this cliff because whether or not meant as metaphor, there are sickos out there who will happily take it literally. It is almost a catechism by now, except that in Arizona, both parts in the little play have now been performed by the same person. Her name is Carmen Mercer, and she is or was the president of the MCDC, the Minuteman Civil Defense Corps. Its anti-immigration members stand watch on the U.S. border. Cynics say they stand around. Anyway, 13 days ago, they got an email from Ms. Mercer urging a change in their own rules that would permit them to not just report illegals and international drug carriers, but to track them. Angry over a claim that the border was now secure, and of course, angry over health care reform, Ms. Mercer urged her membership to go to the border to protest. You are strongly encouraged, she wrote, to exercise your rights and duty as an American citizen to carry a long arm, and if challenged, use it to defend the United States of America. She added the volunteers should come locked, loaded, and ready. Guess what happened next? Carmen Mercer suddenly found out that a surprisingly large number of her email correspondence took her literally. People are ready to come locked and loaded, and that's not what we're all about, she now says. It only takes one bad apple to destroy everything we've done for the last eight years. Apparently, Ms. Mercer misunderstood her membership. When she said locked, loaded, and ready, she did not think this would translate as bring your guns to a bunch of nutbags looking to shoot people who do not look like them, as one Minuteman member allegedly did last year, killing an immigrant and his nine-year-old daughter. Ms. Mercer thought they'd get the subtle imagery she obviously intended. To her credit, when the scales suddenly fell from her eyes, she did something unexpected. On Friday, Carmen Mercer and her board of directors voted to dissolve the Minuteman Corporation because for whichever reason, people taking locked, loaded, and ready, literally, was way too much for her. Perhaps there is a lesson in this for a much more high-profile agitator who does not understand the stupidity of her own supporters and who recently advised them, don't retreat, instead, reload.